boy. Pretty good boy. Today I got Loki here. I'll just slide over a little bit, Loki. Or maybe you just come on this side, buddy. You just come on this side. There we go. There we go. There's my big fella. Loki's been here training on the Desna training program. I hope we're in that camera. Let me just, uh, let's just move back up here, buddy. Come here. Come here, Loki. There we go. Right. Come, buddy. And I got Jaeger, man. What a fantastic day today. Jaeger, come in the film. Jaeger. We we'll just do a video here, Jaeger. All right, boy. All right, boy. You just sit by me for a few minutes. All right. All right. Jaeger, you stay by me for a minute. Stay right up here. Come here. Come on up here. Jaeger, come by me for a minute. Come. All right. Good. That's my boy. Good. You just stay here so Loki stays. Good. Good. Good boy, Loki. Come by me, buddy. Good boy. What a good boy. Good boy. Oh, that's a good boy. What a good boy. What a good boy. What a fantastic fella. Sure good boy. Sure good boy. So these two fellas, I'll tell you, they're pretty phenomenal to hike with. This is old world boys, these guys. Jaeger, he's uh, absolutely incredible. He's just such a rock out here. And uh, Jaeger is the old working line. He's, he's all work. No show genetics. He's all work. He's been been bred to work his whole genetic heritage right back to the start of time. That's one of the very, very old lines. Now that genetic, the same genetic that flows through Jaeger, flows right into here. Now let's just check that camera. I heard it click there, buddy. Let me just check that. No, oh, we're still going good. All right. You come by me, big fella. Now Jaeger, he uh, he shares a lot of genetics with Loki. Jaeger's father is the great grandfather of this pup, and uh, these old boys they're uh, they're out of the very very best working lines in the world, and they trace back to the old Sweden and Norway dogs, and very very good dogs. Now, show breeders have been working to breed this genetic line out. It's quite a shame. But uh, we love this line, so we keep this line alive. This is, uh, in my opinion, one of the very best lineages in the elk hunt world. The old boys in Sweden and Norway, they still got lots of these guys yet. But in North America, it's very, I'm the only guy with it. Now, uh, for anybody in North America, one of the most famous dogs out of the old lineage that these dogs come from, of course, is uh, President Luke's dog. So that dog came from the same, uh, same background. And those dogs were good. Oh, my goodness. Now, these two boys, we had them. I w we hiked up to the highest spring we got. It's right over in this bush here. And believe it or not, there's a ton of water coming yet. And we're at late July. There's only 300 feet left to go up. And uh, there's, there's water in there. So these guys got wet feet out of it and had a good drink. I, uh, I thought, well, we'll go to the, see, I can go to the water first with Jaeger because he doesn't climb all over me. Jaeger is, uh, he, he's a perimeter dog, he, very, very sharp dog, he's on my perimeter all the time, 
Digger, come by me. Now he's right on the bit. I want him. He's here, but uh, he's a real working hound, I'll tell you. Now the personable nature of this guy is incredible. Look at how rock steady this dog is. Look at how focused this guy is. It's just amazing. Now he's going to, down to Brian and his family and uh, two young young uh, handlers there. Boy, they, they are going to have themselves a rock solid male there. Now we've been doing some leash work with him. He's very good. He comes down to the creek with me every night on the leash. And, we go through different trails and stuff. And his sit and stay, they'll have to work on that. He's still, uh, he'll come and stand by me, but he won't come and sit. He's a stander. It's kind of funny. And you got to work with personalities of each dog, right? Jaeger, come by me. <clears throat> now he's sharp, this little guy. He's watching absolutely everything. All the game comes up through this water channel here. And so uh, these boys are hearing stuff all the time, smelling stuff. Jaeger, come on in the video. And uh, so, yeah, it's pretty interesting. Loki, he's keeping a sharp eye out. He's a good boy. A good, good dog to hike with, boy. What do you got, buddy? What do you got? I'll just swing over there. He's a sharp fella. He's a sharp fella. <laughs> good boy. Good boy. a little further. Good boy, Loki. We can hear him moving through the timber. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Unfortunately, there's no opening for them to come out. Hear them? See the moose, they hang right around in this, uh, all this aspen, this willows, hang right through there. Now, Loki, he knows where they are. He's a sharp boy. Good boy, Loki. <laughs> Good boy. Yeah, good boy. Big old bull moose down there would be pretty cool if he would have come out. That would be all right. Loki would have stopped him. What do you got over here, buddy? What do you got? What do you got, mister? What do you got? Jaeger, what you got there, buddy? Jaeger's to my right here. He got something too, if you Swing over that way. Jaeger, come by me. Loki, Jaeger.
Good boy. You keep an eye on him. Okay. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Whatever Xavier's got in that bush, he's going to stay with it, and that's all right. That's okay. You come and sit by me, Loki. You come by me, boy. things keep an eye on things very very good yeah very nice to be around good sharp boys really a nice uh, family dog you can go hiking and relax you know they're keeping an eye on things very very good now at 16 weeks lots of training left but lots done um, the ability to focus, the ability to stick around, um, very, very good. Now, a lot of pups, you see, would have ran down there barking their face off at that there, and Loki just let me know he was there, and that's that. Just uh, very steady, very calm, very good fella, not worried a bit, just letting me know. So, pretty cool. I sure hope it picked up the noise of them traveling through the bush there. Um, if there was an opening or something down below, I would have went down there, but we won't catch them. Now, had I put Jaeger on them, Jaeger would have worked them out into the bush, but uh, out of the bush into the opening. But Jaeger won't go unless I release him. So he's excellent, and it's no threat, so uh, it's a, a moose or a deer, elk, not a bear, or he'd be alert. But Loki, he's just young yet, and he's happy. He's, he let me know, boy, that's really awesome. So we got pups like this, exactly like this, matter of fact. Uh, Tika has a litter of eight. Now, they're all spoken for, but Jaeger, I potentially am going to use Jaeger with Tuba, and she's probably going to cycle fairly soon. Now, my goal is to use Jaeger's dad if he's, if he's still up to it, and I'm going to let him have a crack at it, and if he can't make her work, so be it, then we'll... Uh, We'll make a litter uh, one way or the other with uh, Jaeger or his dad, Dakota, with Tuba. And uh, those will be awesome dogs. Jaeger, come by me now. So we got you in the video for a little bit. Jaeger, come. Come on in the video for a few minutes, buddy. Come up by me, Jaeger. Right up here, buddy. Just right up here. What have you been doing, mister? You stay by me. Stay in the video for a few minutes here. But, okay, that's good. He wants to sit in the shade. That's all right. You just stay right there, mister. Now, Jaeger's normally up with my daughter, and uh, he's down with me now for this week. No, nope, you stay right by me. Hey, it's in the video here. You just sit right there. Right there. No, no, no. Right there. Sit right down. Right. You can stay by me for a minute. You can stay by me for a minute. You can leave what's in that bush. Donna. Right here. Don't take it. We're filming a video here. Right there. Right. Boy. Way to go. So yeah, that 
a combination of genetics with tuba, oh my goodness. Now Jaeger, he's a beautiful dog to work with. He's not uh, not this ultra friendly stuff. He's a very personable dog, very nice dog, but it doesn't drive you crazy. Good dog to work with. Knows what his role is and does it well. Very, very stout fella. He's a big boy and uh, he's 15 pounds or so heavier than Leaf. And uh, very, very good, very good fella. Now he, he has a few um, issues coming back in the yard, of course, because he'd like to take over. But uh, his dad and his brother Mon there, they're not, uh, they're not too keen on that just yet. So they're not letting that occur. And the females all back up the other two males. So Jaeger just doesn't have the have the opportunity yet to rule. So he gets a little uptight about that he'd like to rule but that's okay his time's coming but uh, he'll have to deal with his brother Mon because his brother is uh, not wanting to turn that over now maybe I can turn and we can film them boys he's not going to stay with me so let's just see what he's trapping over there now this camera looks way off A lot of smoke today. It's not too bad up here yet. I don't uh, notice it all that much. The dogs, I can see a little bit around their noses. They're getting agitated a little bit, but it's uh, better up here than down low. Down in the valleys, it's worse. These are the final Desna days for these pups. They're heading home. So we're just out having final Desna hikes. They're very good. They're all skilled. I don't have to train anymore. Now I can just let them work. They just work, so it's quite nice. And uh, very, very good dogs to just start working with. If I kept that dog right there, you see, he'd just be working away for the rest of his life. He's, uh, he's all set. There's not much more I would do with him. I mean, he does exactly what he's supposed to do for the work I have. I mean, yeah, you can teach him to sit, you can teach him to stay down and all those fancy things, but I never use those things, so I never train him. Basically, I want him to look out for me in, in the remote timber. Jaeger, you didn't come out of that bush, or what do you got in there? got to be something pretty enticing in there. Loki, he's sitting right down here at my feet. Well, buddy, that's uh, good enough. <laughs>